Dave and Kale, I got a nice burr for us to look into. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey folks, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show on Holton Wise TV. As always, I'm your host, James Wise, and today's show, uh, my two dudes, Dave and Kale. Man, I love you guys. You guys are just some badass, aggressive investors, and you guys go with the flow. You guys get it, man. I feel like you guys get the picture, dude. Uh, we've been slinging offers all around town, and uh, some of them have gone through. Others have not, uh, but you guys, that's why I like you guys. You guys get it. You're not getting disenfranchised. You're getting your numbers. You're getting your target numbers. We're making our offers. If the deals go through, great. If they don't, hey, that's cool. We're stepping back. We're looking at new properties, and a lot of these sellers, man, some of them might come back to us, right? Some people, they get into the negotiation stage and they fall in love with the deal. You guys are smart. Don't do that, right? We ran our numbers. We know what makes sense. We know the targets we got to hit. If we don't, we move on. And, uh, you know, there's a bunch of properties out there. And if them sellers come back to our numbers, great. We'll do the deal. If not, we keep it moving, right? Just uh, putting lines in the water. And this one hit the market literally today. So I knew I needed to get it to you guys so you guys can bid on it because this is, this is Dave and Kale all day, right? Zero days on the market. Literally just hit the market. I, I found this property on the market literally 10 minutes ago. I'm like, dude, let me uh, do a quick number analysis. This is very similar to a lot of the deals. I need to send this to you too. 4125 Poe, Cleveland, 4 for 109. Just listed thirty. $8,000 is the price. It's a three-bed, one-bath, and it's all types of fucked up, dude. It's all fucked up, guys. One owner for, like, the last 50 years. It's an estate sale, right? So, uh, you know, doesn't look like much has been done, right? It looks like we had an elderly uh, person living there, right? <clears throat> so... We're going to bust out a whole shebang on this, right? <laughs> Obviously, the uh, the wood paneling ain't going to fly. Uh, the way these deals typically work, just so you guys are aware, like all the crap that you see here, that's probably going to be there uh, when we close. So you'll, you're probably going to have to pay to get that removed. That might be another grand or two added onto the budget. Sometimes uh, the estates and the families, they do clear it out because they want some of this stuff. Um, but what usually happens is they go through and they take what they do want and they just leave everything. So that just going to be a little bit of uh, additional stuff that we're probably going to have to deal with. Uh, no biggie. Kitchen, obviously, full reno in the kitchen, right? This ain't going to cut it. Uh, just so you're aware, uh, I would imagine you can probably tell from the picture, but if you can't, this is not real brick. This is not exposed brick. This is like a, like a brick wallpaper type deal, so that's not going to fly. We're going to have to get rid of that. Uh, you guys are kind of familiar with the process, the reno process, and like what we're going to want to do to these homes. You know, we're going to hit the whole thing, right? The, cos uh, the cosmetics is just not going to work anywhere, of course, right? It's like 50 years old uh, since anything has been done, right? So we're not going to be able to get new, fresh tenants in here digging this. So we're going to do it all, man. Floors, walls, kitchens, baths, updated fixtures, etc. As far as the basement goes... Uh, this hot water tank, it looks actually not that old, so we may not need to replace that. Furnace is like a 20-something-year-old furnace, so uh, we may or may not want to replace that. Up to you guys. And then we're also going to want to throw a shed in the backyard because there is not a garage. Now, it's okay. We're in Cleveland, so we don't necessarily need a garage here. Um, Cleveland itself does not require you to build new garages. Some of the cities do, the POS cities they do. So I have a video w with explaining what POS is in the Cleveland market, where it is, all that jazz, uh, in the show notes below. So anybody watching this is like, what the hell is he talking about, POS? Uh, just pause this video, check that out. I'm going to assume you all know what I'm talking about going forward now. So Cleveland, not a POS city. A lot of, lot of neighboring municipalities in the Cleveland market are POS cities. So... With what we see there, dudes, I want to try to pick this up. It's 38 Gs, but I want to just go in hot, you know, 28K. I think we got to pick it up at 28K because I have budgeted 30K for this 
renovation. Now, what I'd like to do, the normal stuff, right? The $20,000 is about what it's going to be to renovate a home of this size cosmetically. That's agreeable gray walls, white trim, good-looking floors. There's probably nice hardwoods under there. We're going to buff them out, refinish them, get a nice vinyl floor in the kitchen, okay? Updated kitchen, updated bathroom, right? Countertops, the whole, whole shebang. That's going to be about 20 Gs. Now, I got another 10K budgeted, okay? Another 10K. I don't exactly know what it's going to be used for because it could be some. It could not be some, right? Things that are going to be on our radar. Furnaces, they're three. A shed, that's a G. H2O tank, that's another G. A roof, five, maybe six, maybe seven. Five to seven. It's hard to tell. Uh, specifically, five on the low end, seven on the high end, right? Do I know that you'll have to do all of those? No, I don't. Do I think you'll have to do none of those? No, I don't. I think you're going to do some of them, right? So it's smart for us to budget about $10,000. Now, after we do that, we'd be all in at 58 if we pick it up for our price. We'd get a Section 8 tenant in that thing paying 1000 bucks a month, $12,000 a year, no issues. Of that thousand, I'd anticipate four sixty-three going out towards our average expenses, so that'd be five thirty-seven. Now at fifty-eight G's, that would be an eleven point one cap. And what we'd want to do is we'd want to do a burr, man. This is where it gets exciting. This is where it gets awesome. I believe with the twenty thousand dollars of cosmetic work plus factoring in ten thousand dollars for some of those big ticket items, I think we can get an appraiser to go ahead and appraise this sucker at seventy G's for us. So that would be fifty two five. Coming back to you. You two dudes, so you guys would only end up at 5500 in the deal, which would be a 69% cash on cash return. Now, as far as the neighborhood, you guys are aware we've been doing a lot of deals over here. This is all you dudes. This is the Clark Fulton neighborhood, the Metro Health neighborhood, right? You guys are all about this neighborhood. All right. We've done many, many deals uh, together in this neighborhood, right? trying to get this just right one second let me try to get this on the screen just right so everybody can see what i'm trying to do all right here we go all right so this right here is the metro health campus this is the home they're putting a billion dollars into this campus for everyone who's unaware. Billion dollar investment's been committed by Metro. It's going to go into the campus. It's also going to go into building affordable housing in the surrounding neighborhood right so Billion bucks going there. We're right in the same neighborhood. D-class neighborhood currently. I believe it's on the upswing because of that billion dollars, number one. And then if we go north, just north, all right, we got all the good stuff, the popular stuff, okay? Tremont, Detroit Shoreway. Ohio City, you got downtown right there, right? That's the hot spots. Right over here, you got Edgewater and stuff, right? Those are the hot spots in Cleveland. That's what people like, right? So we're right there. We're just south of that, and we're injecting a billion bones. So that's why I like this neighborhood. I think it's going to be on the upswing. But we got to put Section 8 tenants in there right now because I don't think the neighborhood's stable enough to support cash-paying tenants and give you a reasonable expectation of performance, right? So I want to alleviate the risks of a low-income neighborhood currently today by going Section 8. And I think we're going to probably see some appreciation in the future, but we're not going to pay for that right now. So that's why I like this deal. That's why we've been hitting this strategy hard, the three of us. And uh, that's why the moment this hit the market, I was like, dude, Dave and Kale, I know they're going to want to bid on this, so let me get them a video. Let me, uh, you know, show them what's up. So you guys know the drill. Everybody else, if you're watching this, if you'd like me in your corner coming on here, making shows for you personally, showing you deals, getting to know you, getting to know your investment criteria, getting to know your wants and your needs, right? Like me, Dave, and Kale, we haven't been on this like, uh, you know, streamline wavelength forever, right? It, it took a lot of videos, a lot of analysis to really have my team get to know what these guys are trying to do, right? And that's what we could do for you guys. I recommend uh, you guys get the larger packages uh, to have that, um, you know, that connectivity and that connection so we know what you're trying to do. So to do that, you go to the Property Search for Sale tab, guys, and you click on the MLS Search Analysis Show. And these are all the packages. And you could start uh, with like a one or two property package, guys, but I think you need to do the bulk packages. 
uh, 10 properties, right? So we could really work together back and forth. And we're always out there looking for deals for you, searching for deals. Because we, you know, we could sell you properties on the Investment Properties for Sale show. Anybody who just wants to bid on our inventory, check out that show, subscribe to the mailing list. We'll email it to you every day. But that's just going to be what's available, what's on the inventory. We send that show out every day. It doesn't matter what you're looking for. Everybody gets on the list. The same stuff gets sent out, right? So uh, unless you're working with us one-on-one, -on -one, like Dave and Kale are, and we're doing these videos for you personally, we don't care what you want because we're sending it to everybody. Everybody gets it. You know, the 36,000 uh, subscribers to Holton Wise TV, they all get the same content, right? But if you want personalized content, you want us looking for you personally, you got to do the packages. And I like the 10 property package because you eventually build a rapport and I could, you know, as soon as I see a property, I think of you and then I hop on here and make a video. With Dave and Kale uh, together, in totality, we're doing 40 properties. We've committed to doing 40 properties together this year because these two dudes are building a big motherfucking portfolio out here in Cleveland. There's some uh, oil and gas guys down there in Texas, right? So they're pulling their funds. You know, these packages are great. If uh, you're an aggressive guy or gal and, uh, you know, you got coworkers who are also trying to put some together, you guys wanted to go big, you know, no reason y'all can't go together like four of you, two, three, four of you, and you guys kind of all go together, make yourself a little LLC and start building your uh, portfolio, pulling all your resources, right? Dispersing that risk. That's what those dudes are doing, and we're scaling this thing up quick, guys. So that's, uh, that's what we got for you guys today here on Holton Wise TV. Hope you enjoyed the show. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Based in Indianapolis, Indiana, FS Houses is the premier investment property brokerage with an in-house property management department that can take care of all those unwanted landlord headaches. FS Houses can offer you the complete turnkey solution as well as wholesale properties offered to you at a discounted rate. With a network of thousands of active investors, wholesalers, and brokers, FS Houses can help you sell your property for top dollar on the open market or in a hurry to motivated investors seeking distressed real estate. Visit fshouses.com or call 317-492-9025 for more information on the Indianapolis, Indiana real estate. Discount Property Warehouse, founded by real estate visionary Robert Thiel, author of The Short-Term Retirement Program, is a complete turnkey solution for acquiring cash flowing investment properties in Memphis, Tennessee. Our turnkey properties include a third party home inspection, new HVAC with 10 year warranties, new dimensional roofs, competitive price to rent ratios, discounted property insurance, in-house property management, private financing, and much more. At Discount Property Warehouse, we have a staff of licensed agents standing by, ready to assist you with every aspect of the process. Call us today or visit us online at DiscountPropertyWarehouse.com. U.S. Reeb is a full-service turnkey provider offering investors the opportunity to purchase single-family and multi-family investment properties in Cincinnati, Ohio, Dayton, Ohio, and Kansas City, Missouri. The purchase process is seamless, from reserving a property to obtaining financing, inspections, and insurance referrals. U.S. REAP has a dedicated team in place to manage the process from start to finish. In addition, U.S. REAP is also directly integrated with its own private placement fund for accredited investors. The fund seeks to raise $10 million to capitalize on the repositioning of distressed single-family and multifamily real estate. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content, including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, 
real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from hell. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.